Please explain to me why my footage that I had stored in my app, my videos, at least two weeks worth of footage, gone. I'm so freaking annoyed. Hey y'all, it's your girl Kia Janae of Pretty V Vlogs and I'm here with another video. On this channel we do all things glam, all things decor, shopping and more. Today is Wednesday, it is July the 24th and I'm a little irritated y'all. I'ma just start it off with that because please explain to me why my footage that I had stored in my app, my videos, at least two weeks worth of footage gone deleted disappeared i'm so freaking annoyed so as y'all may know some of y'all may know some may not i don't know whatever if i mentioned it before but i record off my phone i do my videos off my phone i have yet to buy a camera i have looked at some different types of vlogging cameras that i kind of contemplated getting but I don't know if I want to drop that kind of coin right now because the cameras that I'm looking at is anywhere between like four to seven hundred dollars. So I see a lot of YouTubers and I watch YouTubers and they still record off of their, you know, phone and they have like, you know, high numbers, videos look decent, whatever. And for me, it's just easier. So the only issue with the phone thing is, of course, you know, eventually you run out of storage and you have to either uh, buy more storage or, or put one of those. I don't even know what you call it, but one of those things you stick in your phone and you can like take pictures off of and, and like, what is it? The scan disk, the drives, whatever. I don't know what they are. I can't think right now because I'm irritated. But anyway, so like I was saying, I record off my phone and basically over these last couple of days i haven't really posted anything because i have been trying to upload videos and they kept telling me storage full um go to your settings remove some stuff you know whatever whatever because the app that i do my videos in that i edit my videos in is CapCut. it wasn't letting me download or you know transfer over any of my videos so i'm on here basically deleted everything off my phone like apps you know certain apps i put on my phone and i only leave them on there when i'm using it and then when i'm not using them more and i ain't using them for a long time i take them off now any app that i've taken off removed offloaded whatever you want to call it anytime i'm ready to put it back on my phone i'm able to put it back on my phone and there's no issue all of my info is still there but for some reason after deleting uh, messages uh, deleting apps, offloading apps, deleting photos, sending photos over to the iCloud, uh, back backing up my phone, like all the stuff I'm doing, and it's still showing me the same thing, like it ain't made no difference. So I um, do my thumbnails and stuff like that on an app called Canva. I even took that off, and when I take that off and I put it back up, all my info's still there. So the very last app I decided to, first I offloaded it, was the CapCut. Offloaded it, noticed that, that, you know, me doing that, it still didn't give me no storage or at least it still wasn't allowing, you know, me to do anything. So I said, okay, well, I'm thinking and assuming that it's like the other um, apps that I've taken off and then I'm able to put back on and everything's fine. Apparently not because I go and I take the app off my phone and then by me doing that it shows me I have all the storage available. I even bought extra what is it like iCloud um, iCloud storage for CapCut and for like my, my phone. <laughs> Y'all I go to put that app back on there and none of my videos are there. I don't even know if I'm explaining this right to where it makes sense. All I know is that all the videos that I created over the last two weeks, and I probably had at least eight of them on there, because I was pretty much doing a video almost every day, every other day, or I had stuff on there where I had declutter, 
um i don't even know if i posted that video but i decluttered my um cleaned out my bathroom again decluttered my linen closet cleaned up and rearranged my kitchen decluttered my jewelry box i moved a futon from my um ladies lounge into my bedroom rearranged my furniture again clean my, i had so much stuff i had footage of where i went to stores and got um you know walk through shop with me's and stuff all of that gone gone so yeah i'm irritated and pissed today but right now just um i'm in my husband's truck too if y'all can't tell i don't have my truck right now i'm supposed to be getting my brakes checked went to get in my truck what was it monday to go to work and brakes started sounding like they were grinding it don't sound like squeaking it was squeaking for a little bit i mentioned to my husband that we need to get it looked at and like i say go to pull off the other day and i heard some grinding so i'll mess with that ain't nobody trying to get it down to where i need rotors and all this other stuff replaced because that's expensive i can deal with some pads but supposed to be taking it to a mechanic i go to he wanted me to drop it off this week but the only thing with him is when we drop it off to him he needs to keep it for like a few days because he's really busy on the weekend so he don't really have time to look at vehicles or repair vehicles on the weekend anymore so he asked for you to drop it off during the week after like a certain time which normally means you're not going to have your vehicle for the rest of that day or the next day sometimes it might be an additional day depending on what's going on or what he finds or what you're asking him to work on i ain't got time to be without a vehicle but like i said we do have another vehicle which is my husband's truck which i'm in now but we don't drive it that much because it has some issues going on my husband is working on getting fixed and i just don't feel it's nothing like driving your own vehicle that's all I'm going to say. So, last two days, I've been in his truck. Um, just got off work. We're at the Wawa about to get, um, I guess, a smoothie and some, some sandwiches. Hubby's on the app ordering the stuff now. But I just wanted to pop on here and I guess start a whole new video all over again. Like I said, today is the 24th. I think maybe the last video I might have posted might have been around maybe the 11th or the 12th i don't know but i know i had videos from all the way from the 14th all the way pretty much up until the other day i had a video vlog that i had started that was supposed to be a weekly vlog for this whole week footage gone everything erased i'm just i will probably have to just break down and get me a camera that's what I'm probably going to end up doing because it seems like at this point, and I'm not buying no more storage, no more iCloud storage, no more nothing. I'm just not going to do it. So it seems like I may only be able to maybe do one or two videos at a time because like I said, I'm trying to pull away from uploading a video every day. I want to try to more so go to uploading only on, I think I had said like Tuesdays, Thursdays and Saturdays. But at this rate, because like I say, I can almost make footage out of anything when I'm out and about, when I'm cleaning, when I'm tidying up, when I'm doing my shopping walkthroughs, when I just want to, you know, jump on here and just chit chat with y'all. But y'all, it had me so hot at work today. I was so mad. I had to call my husband. I texted him first and I was like, mean face, cussing face emoji. Why is all my footage gone? And I had to get on the phone and call him because I was just like, he's like, I understand, you know, maybe if you wait a minute and maybe it might come back up. That shit ain't come back up. My video's still gone. That was like at 10 something this morning and the time is now, is your clock right? The time is now 310. Shit still ain't there. But anyway, y'all, I'm about to get these sandwiches, about to get these smoothies and I may go ahead before I head in the house because I am in my eating window. I'm going to do a, probably a quick walk through through that new Burlington they put in my area. It'll be my second time going. Um, I think the last time I went might have been like three weeks or something ago. But I'm going to do a quick walk through, see what inventory they got this week. Add it into this video. And I guess I won't be doing any more videos until I upload this video to YouTube. Like, I don't even know at this point. But what do for the people who is watching my video 
or the people who do uh, record their videos on a camera do y'all have any suggestions of the best camera to use for vlogging I don't need nothing super expensive to be honest I was looking to pay really don't want to pay more than two hundred dollars for no little vlog for no little vlogging camera but like I said from googling the cameras I've been looking at like one is by Sony which when I googled it said that that's like a top beginner vlogger camera I think that one was like it was either $399 or $499 and then the other camera I was looking at was a Canon and that one was either $399 or $499 and of course they do have other ones on there that I guess more advanced I'm not that techie so I don't need anything that's going to be super hard for me to get videos off of um, put videos on I don't need anything like super difficult because like I said I'm not that techie but if any of y'all have any suggestions of a good, reasonably priced camera that you can use for vlogging, please drop the comments below. Let me know so I can go look them up, do some more research. I really still ain't trying to buy a camera, but if I have to keep going through this, and this is the first time this has happened to me since I've been doing YouTube where my footage had just been gone like that. <sighs> if y'all have any suggestions, Please just leave a comment. I'm getting mad all over again every time I think about it. Anyway, about to get these sandwiches in this smoothie. And I'm going to head over to Burlington. I'm going to give y'all some footage of my walkthrough. Whatever I see that's cute, I'm going to add it in here. And I'll pick y'all up later.
Hey y'all, so I'm home and did a walkthrough through Burlington. They had some cute stuff there. The store kind of still looks, you know, decent. It don't look too crazy yet. Um, I'm about to go ahead and end this video because I'm about to eat my food. I'm going to relax for the rest of this evening. Me and hubby about to watch a movie, chill out, and I'm going to actually get back with y'all probably tomorrow or if not tomorrow, at least by Friday. Because I do have a package from Timu that I've been holding on to for probably about two weeks now because I wanted to do a video of it. I guess luckily I didn't do a video already because it would have been deleted in the other videos that I lost on a cap cut. Anyway, I'm going to do that video, like I said, if not tomorrow, Friday, so y'all can see what I got. It's nothing, you know, extravagant. It's just probably, from what I remember maybe a couple of pair of slides and I think two personalized like beach towels one for me one for hubby and I think like two or three bathing suits but I'm gonna share that with y'all in another video I will talk to you all later thanks for watching thanks for subscribing if you haven't hit that subscribe button yet you need to go ahead and do that and I'll talk to you guys later hey, because you are so pretty 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 Thanks for watching.